Hi viewers, welcome to EC Fair Edu Blog. Uh, in today's video, we'll be looking at the interpretation to chemistry practical for LEGO 2023, uh, June July, uh, which is scheduled to begin uh, this month. So we're going to be looking at um, the prospective question and trying to preempt, preempt the examiners. So you're going to see the question on the screen and they will just deal with it immediately. But you are giving three items A, B, C. Label A and D and B. So this is acid, this is base. Acid is H2SO4 and the base is sodium carbonate pellet and salt is also sodium carbonate. The two things are similar. So but this two is for number one, this is for number two. Number three will be a general question. Okay. So in this uh, video, we are going to be looking at finding the concentration of base. Okay, so the examiner is likely to give you the concentration of the acid. Maybe see a question that A, see a question A is a solution of 0 0.0300 mole per DMQ of H2SO4. Okay, and then B is a solution of of Na2CO3. Okay, Na2CO3 and then your solution as well. Okay, you see the screen there. So of course you have to put this in the breads and then titrates. Okay, in today's video, we're going to look at, uh, we're not doing the practical here, but we'll show you how you fill in the table once you're done with your experiment. As you're carrying the experiment, you're putting up your table. So here we're going to be looking at 28.30 as here. Our title value, okay? So the table uh, is quite different from that of Baek. In that, you're going to do four experiments. Oh, four experiments. This is for four experiments. Okay, you have something like this. This is how it will look like. Okay, this is a red reading. Okay, and this is the titration. Titration figures. You have reading the titrations. And here you have final reading. Make sure your units were placed. Initial reading units volume of a use. Make sure units are there. This is first, sorry, rough, first, second, third. Okay, so likely we use 0, 0.00 here. 0.00 here, 1.00 here, 2.00 here. Okay, since this is rough, you can just hide this figure to 29.50. You can come down to this here, 28.30, 28.30, 28 28.40. We have something like this. This is 29.50, 28.40. .30, okay, this is what we have for the table. Okay, so next is to this is question number A. Next is to find the average title. So you now see for the table, and I see average, average volume of A used. I will use this to is what 28.30 plus 28.30 divided by 2 so i have 28.30 centimeter cube this is actually my volume of acid so pause the video this table is very very important it's up to it's it's max okay so we'll straight go to question number b question b r we are going to look find the concentration of b in mobile dnk okay but first you have to balance the equation Force, so we have H2SO4 plus the base. So this is going to give us 
salt, sulfate salt, water, then CO2. So just to know the more ratio, one is to one. Okay? So that's the more ratio. So here we are going to use it. C A V A all over C B V B plus two N A all over N A B or don't waste any time one over one. one. So it's substituting immediately. So what are you substituting? You substitute this sign. What is your C A? Look at it here. Zero point zero three zero zero. Because you see a question that says big question from the information on results from your result and the information. Look at the information here. So this is one of the information times this. 28.30 upon CB times volume is given. You must record this for this table. This cos of all over 1. So, what we do here is to cross multiply. So, cross multiply, you have this times this times this given 25 CB is equal to this times this times this 0 0.849. 0 0.849. 0 0.849. Okay, what do you do? Divide both sides. By this coefficient of B, C, B, 25. Okay, here is 25. Here, 25. 25 here, 25 here. So here I have my C, B now is equals to 0 0.0339. 0 0.0339. 0 it should be 0 0.0340 mole per DM. Please make sure write mole per DM. That is for question number. B I. Okay, now let's do question number B I I. We know that the mass concentration of B wasn't given, so we're going to find concentration of B in gram per dm cube B I I. How do we find concentration of this in gram per dm cube? Okay, to find concentration of B in gram per dm cube, now we know the molar. We know the molar comp of B. So here, molar comp of B, molar conch of B is 0 0.0340, okay, okay, molar mass, molar mass of B, B is NA to CO3, which is 23 times 2 plus 12 plus 16 times 3, okay, 16 is the atomic mass of oxygen, so here we have 46 plus 12 plus 48, so all together we have 106, so that's the molar mass of this. So now, we are going to find the mass conch of what? B. The mass conch of B. B is the Na2 CO3. This is unknown. So okay, let's do it here. So let's use this relation here that molar conch is equal to mass conch over molar mass. Okay, so let's now plug in these values here. So our molar conch is 0 0.0340 is equal to mass conch. That's concentration in gram per cube all over molar mass 106. So when we cross multiply, okay, we now have that mass conch of the B is equal to this times this 0 0.0344 times 106. That is going to give us. 3.597. 3. 3. 3. 3. It should be 3.6, 3.60 gram per dm cube. Please make sure the unit is very important. 3.60 gram per watt dm cube. That is the mass concentration of the base. Okay. Then the last um, we saw the last question that is a. Um, I, 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 we should find the volume of the gas, the volume of this gas that was given up. Okay, you can pause the video and then watch what we did so far before the last uh, question is solved on question number one. Okay. So this, um, some information will be very important for us to solve that. I'm going to I'm going to actually use this. Let me write the figure here. 0 0.0340. That is the molar conch of B. I can also use 3.60. That is mass conch of B to solve the volume of carbon dioxide. So these are the only information I need for now. Okay? 
Now, let's find the volume of the gas involved during the reaction. Okay, so here we have question B, I, I, I. Okay, now how do you find volume of the gas? Let me state the equation very clearly here. Yeah? The equation is between these salts, which we use here as a base, a weak base, plus this acid, and then going forward, we have the salts, Okay, then we have water, then we have a gas. Okay, a gas. Okay, now, so in this is how many moles? First, basically, this gas here was evolved from this. So our interest will be this and this. Okay, in this question, this and this. So how many moles of this reacted in this equation? Once this equation is balanced, we already have the stoichiometry, the amounts, okay? The amount of this that reacted with this is one mole. Okay? And well, it was able to give me one mole of CO2. Okay? So I can say, therefore, from the equation, from the equation, comma, one mole of Na2CO3 reacted to produce one mole of CO2 gas. Okay, this is actually four statements. Okay, the second of all is that you can say that but one mole of Na2 CO3 is equal to its molar mass. Its molar mass is 106, remember? Okay, remember? 106. Then one mole of CO2, one mole of every gas occupies 22.4 DMQ. Okay, therefore, I will now say that 106 gram, 106 gram of Na2CO3 reacted this time, reacted to produce, to produce one mole, which is 22.4. DMQ of CO2. Okay, now that I'm using mass, mass here to solve, what I will do now is I will no longer use this, but I'll use this. Okay, and I'll say that if this produces this, then 3.6 of Na2CO3 reacted to produce X. Okay, then you cross multiply to find the volume of the gas which is X liberated. Let's say, therefore, X is equal to 3.6 times the volume which is 22.4 over the molar mass, 106. So, what is my answer? You can pause the video and use your calculator. That would give me X is. That will be, that is the volume in 1.0 DMQ. Take notes. 0 0.76. 0 0.76. 760 DMQ. Uh, what if you ask to find it in, in CMQ? That means you convert it to DMQ by multiplying this by 1000. I think that will give you, this time, what does that will give you? 760 centimeter per kilometer. Of the gas was liberated. Then to see if I still get the same answer, I want to use this to solve. But this time around, I will just end it this way. This is the answer. Okay, pause the video and take note. I'm going to show you another method of uh, getting the answer as as easy as possible. Now, I won't even go far. Now that I have one more, one more, one mole of this reactor to give me one mole of this. One mole of this is two two point four. DMQ. So what it means that one mole of this had already reacted to produce this. Okay, then 0 0.0340 mole of this will react to give me X. So you can cross multiply here and get stay fine to, to see to give you the same answer. X here is going to be 0 0.0340 times 22.4 over 1.
0.761. That gives you a 0 0.76. Okay, 0 0.761. Okay, the, maybe that is probably where we carry do unnecessary approximation, but that is the same thing. So 0 0.06, you can say dm what q. That is the answer. Okay, this is the easiest way to do it. That's why I say that particular value of this, the molarity of this, or the mass comp of this is very, very important in calculating the volume of gas in Britain. Okay, for this exam, I think I'm suspecting that this question is definitely about volume of gas measured in STP. So that is on this note. Uh, that's one, uh, one way this examiners they ask this question. The same, just this way we interpreted it. Okay, but there's another second um, interpretation of the same paper. I will still show you. So you're going to do the comparison to see which one will come out. So either of this, one will definitely come out. So it will be this or the other, uh, the other um, pattern. So for this, for this paper, another way the question. Another way they may likely ask question will be you will see the question on the screen. I'll quickly solve it the same average title, but kind of we change some settings. This time we're not going to ask, we're not going to see where they ask volume. This time we're going to be looking at the possibility whereby they may say that uh, um, 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 that. A is A is a solution of 0 0.0300 mole per dm cube of H2SO4. Okay, and maybe B is B is B is 3.6 gram of X2CO3. Okay? Ah, uh, DMQ. Okay, that's another way. We still see another question. The same table, but this time we'll change the narrative this time around. Oh, okay. Now that we have this, we can say calculate the same way to find the molarity of this from the table, from the results given. So what if you ask to calculate BI concentration conk of B in mole per DNQ? Okay, that's I. I, I, molar mass of X to CO3 in B in gram per mole. And then the last question here. Relative. Relative. Atomic. Mass of X. In X to C to 3. Maybe IV. Percentage composition. Of X in X to C over three. Okay, let's look at this question. The question number A is same as that of the pre uh, does the last uh, video we just did now. So we're going to do this in another approach, similar 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 approach. Does that I I I I I I V somehow changed? Okay. So how do we do this? Remember. Uh, first balance equation to see what happens. So I'll start with BI solution. So we start with the equation first. H2SO4 plus X to CO3. This is coming this way to give me X to SO4 plus H2O plus CO2. So we have more ratio. One is to one. Okay? One this is to one this. Okay, that's what it is. Okay now. So using C A V A upon C B V B is 
1 over 1 to 1. So if you substitute, this is 0 0.0300 times 28.30 over CB times 25.00 plus 1 over 1 to 1. Okay. What do you do? You cross multiply. So here we have here 25 CB is equal to. So here we have 0 0.0300 times 28.30 times 1 gives me what? 0. Can punch, can pause the video. Punch this times, this times is 0 0.849. 0 0.849. Okay. So at this point, divide both sides 25, 25. So what do you have as CB now? 0 0.0339. 0.033964 mu per volt DMQ. Okay, that is the molar count of B. So we just did this. So we quickly go to this. So post the video and see what we just did now. Okay. Now to so the B I part of it. The B I part of it, we quickly find out. 